Hey guys, I'm back with another Kerbal Space Program video and today we will be making or well, showing the Strata Launch aircraft. Now if you haven't heard, uh, Virgin Galactic is some, some company that builds aircrafts that will go into space for a certain amount of time then come back down to earth right? and that costs a lot of money. So I tried to copy it as best as I could here. What will happen is once I get high enough in altitude, this here, that part right there, if you can see, will disconnect and this rocket part will activate, which will take you further into orbit. Uh, we've got a bunch of wings we have these small control surfaces everywhere to help out with the lift I've got st standard cannons, quite a few of them for controlling the aircraft and uh, this thing what's it called again? yeah fuel duct so the fuel can come here to there for some reason the fuel doesn't go from here to there it only goes from here to down there so yeah I've got these avionics package this uh, aerodynamic nose cap we've got a couple wheels underneath, let's have a look at that so I've got these underneath here which are connected with a uh, small hard point so it can reach lo pretty low down on the ground otherwise if this was, if I didn't have the hard point these uh, wheels would be too high and this part of the jet would actually just scrape on the floor and break and Boof, explode. I've tested this a couple of times, it's pretty good. The issue is when you start off, you gotta direct it and don't touch it after that. Because if you change. Okay. Um, if you change the direction, even once, this thing will go wacko. Yeah. So let's. Uh I think this is all good. Give it a try. Launch. It's quite fast with the six engines that we have. And I'll show you pretty soon. If you see here on the left hand side, right, when I when I click space bar, uh, when I'm in high altitude, this part will disconnect and this rocket part will it won't activate until I click spacebar again unless I move this engine part on the left hand side to down here and I can just do that by clicking and dragging and that will en that engine will activate when I want it to but I want that, I want to be able to direct it so that's good T full throttle, spacebar and if this thing lifts up by itself I don't have to do anything just watch it now Na -na -na -na. G, retract those damn wheels. So we're gonna try and lift it up now. And leave it. That's it. Perfect. It's pretty much uh, not going straight up, almost. We've got Kenla aboard. Kenla, how are you? <laughs> I've never had Kenla before. And this thing is it's quite fast for <laughs> low orbit. We've got plenty of jets and rockets that have smashed around this place, but they seem to disappear after a certain time. I don't know. I know there are a couple down there that have landed recently using this very contraption. It goes quite far. Eventually, I'm going to build a jet that will go to Antarctica or the, the North or South Pole because I've seen a guy on YouTube made a big jet <laughs> that actually went to the North Pole and it took him like an hour to actually get there and I've I've made some jets that will go way faster than his one and we'll get there in about 20-30 minutes so I'm gonna click uh, space bar now and now it's disconnected almost yeah almost dis uh, almost stuffed up that thing no Gotta direct the damn thing. Hope we're not falling. 
Yeah, we're full. Alright. Hold on. That ejection point was a bit rubbish. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go a different direction this time. We're gonna go towards the North Pole. It's not gonna go to North Pole, just that way down there. I've kept them going. I'm just gonna go down that way. Um, yeah, I can do that. I can go down that way. Go this. Where's 90? 90 is here. Excellent. Hope we're going the right way. We're still going up, upwards. Yep. So we're on the map. Alright, so this is where we're going to land. Uh, we're probably going to reach down here. Hope we don't reach in the ocean. X. Oh. Oh, the fuel almost wasted too. Look. Like, uh, one pixel. This. Stop it. Stop. Alright, good. Where do we land? Yeah, we might reach that uh, small point there. Nice. Well, as you can see, guys, this is pretty cool. Yeah, it's quite easy to. This part here is quite easy to uh, manage. We've got the SAS module there. Usually, these, these are Virgin Galactic rocket jets <laughs> they usually disconnect the capsule and the capsule comes down I think it comes down by with the uh, parachute but this one we're going we're gonna be able to land it using the, the wheels that we have so if we want to fast forward it I'm gonna click those uh, side arrows or whatever they're called or the uh, dot and the dash or the comma coming down quite fast uh, yeah the positioning of this this craft might slow us down a bit so let's direct it properly yeah that would do now as you see on this uh, this corner thing that yellowish circle that's the point of gravity that's where the main point of gravity is actually pulling us right we're just above that that way we can Hopefully, pass that. Ignore it for the time being. Is this moving backwards? It sort of stopped. We're slowing down as we go slow. <laughs> I don't think we'll be able to make it too fast here. Not easy to control. Yeah. Very fast. Yeah, this is. <laughs> In real life, there'd be so much heat on this point. Quite good. Yeah, we're good. This is another spot where we landed, and this is one. This is a random design. Yeah. Alright, let's click a G to retract these samples. One. Uh, I did it uh, accidentally. <laughs> Should be able to fix that. Oh, I shouldn't do that. Come on, T. I thought this was easier to control. Well, it was maybe because we're going so fast. Yeah, we're going on the sideways now. T. What is this? Ah, oh, please, T. Oh, I just want to land. Successfully, my last one I landed good by the time. Yeah, please be good. Come on, no. Survive, 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 survive. No. What? Ha 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 ha. What the hell is that? Lucky. Now we're probably gonna come crashing down. And. Back down again. 
many meters per second? I've been faster than that. Let's try and pick up some speed so we can actually do that. Come on, Kenla. I need your help here. Do it, Kenla. I'm really surprised we actually made that. I'm pretty sure this part, the engine was in the ground. Someone correct me. Oh, well. I think we can see our shadow. No. Is this picking up speed or what? Yeah, that's a shadow. It's definitely picking up speed. How could we go from 20 kilometers to 50? Alright. This Oh, let's click X. Alright. Come on. B. Great landing. Perfect landing. That, that's... That, why are we rolling? Yeah, click B. Whatever. Take Con Kenla out. Yep, let's just leave him there. Or we can use the Kerbal Space Program glitch and let's see if it works. Let's try and... No, we won't be able to control this thing without... Oh, this is spazzing out. Yeah. But, uh, I hope you guys like the episode. I Next episode, I'll have something a little bit different. It's some random design I found on the internet. So, thanks for watching, and have a nice day.